the briefing room for Thursday, August 2nd meeting. Agenda item number one, discussing the city budget for year 2013 and 14. Uh, Madam Mayor. I would like to request for the benefit of our uh, attorney guests uh, if we could uh, move uh, two and three up. I'm not sure uh, how long uh, the budget portion of it will last, and my concern is if we get lengthy as uh, we have with the budget, then it'll probably be several hours before attorneys have an opportunity to be considered so uh, I'm hoping that we can move the agenda I think it will give us a better showing with them. Well at this point this meeting was called a budget meeting and we would like the most critical important thing in our city right now is working on this budget and we also don't know how long attorney interviews will last and until we have sufficient time on the budget tonight, I'm going to leave it in the first place. Uh, may I ask, uh, as a result of what we're about to talk about, hope, what do we hope to gain? What, what do we hope to take away from this particular meeting? A lot of work on the budget. That's my number one goal. Get as much done on this budget as we can. And hopefully this would be our last meeting can we before take, another public hearing. Can we take a vote? We can not take a vote. Board of order. Can we take a vote? Yes. Yeah. 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 Um, yeah. Do the point of order would I be to follow our <laughs> agenda. Or 4D or whatever is it, what does it say about agenda specifically calls out agenda so that's what it's talking about I was to be a guest tonight and your city attorney is on the road if I can take a look at the rules I will be able to handle that for you she actually is in the middle of two car accidents well that happened right as we were coming and, and I want to speak to this too. I, I don't appreciate that we had a, a budget meeting and someone uh, tapped this on the back because this is not, I don't know what's going on. There's no urgency uh, on changing the terms. So I, I don't know what, what's going on here. I want to get the budget to yeah, because you called a special meeting, and that was the first time my daughter's going on again. That's how we do it. No, that's not how we do it. There you go. I have half the answer. I thought you were waiting half. Half the answer is if someone does call a point of order, then two thirds, which is five, can vote to not conform to the agenda. There she is. Sorry. So how, where, where you have the conflict in the paragraph I referenced about specifically addressing agendas for our meeting? Does that have no merit at all? The council may rearrange the, the order of the meeting. agenda items during a briefing session or during a meeting by majority vote. Yep. That actually sounds more specific than the point of order two-thirds rule. Mm -hmm. And because of its more specific intent, then I, as an assistant city attorney under your city attorney would recommend that it would require a majority vote to rearrange the order. How can that be more specific than, than requiring us to conform to our agenda? Because it specifically says rearranging the order. Yeah, but that's if no one calls a point of order asking for more. Then you can yeah. All right. Um, if someone just asks to rearrange the order of the agenda and no one calls a point of order asking to conform, then it doesn't take a majority vote 
just if someone calls the point of the order under the rules, does that two thirds even come into play? Then that means no reason to have the other one. You could call the point of order any time you want to stop something. We never had this problem. I'm speaking to the attorney. I don't care. We never had this problem. That's right. You don't care. That's the subject. You don't right care. There. Explain that to me, please. Then that means that paragraph never has any merit. Uh, it, it has merit if no one calls a point of order. Yeah, but which has happened a lot. Stuff gets rearranged in briefing session all the time. Never happened. It happened at the other night's meeting. We moved twenty up. And no one, no one called no, a point no. of order. In fact, we uh, oh. there was actually five that agreed to that. Oh, good man. Yeah, because we were hoping to help you rather than under. Madam Mayor, no, I, would, I, would, I really, really would request, Richard, that you will give us some structure at first at our pleasure. Because if we don't have structure, we're going to be all over the place. So you will at least guide us through it. I asked you for the. Did you acknowledge me? Did you acknowledge me? Not really. You did. You looked at me. Uh, Mayor, you're not. You, you are, yes, and I respect you totally, okay? And and so you're not to talk to me, I don't know anybody else, like I'm a child. Who's not your child. Point of order. Okay. Secondly, secondly, if you, you gave me the floor. Secondly, I thought you acknowledged me, and so I was speaking to, I was speaking as a recommendation to the finance director. If you choose to say that's not the way to go, that's fine with me. No. But don't, don't, don't recommend me like I'm a child, okay? Thank you.